RAF Topcliffe, England, September 19, 1952, shortly before 11 a.m. Royal Air Force personnel watch a meteor aircraft coming into land. They spot something unusual following about five miles behind it. And they thought initially, oh no, there's, there's been some kind of accident. It's the cowling from the aircraft or something from the aircraft that's, that's come away and that's falling to earth because these things appear to be following the aircraft and then descending. As they watched, they realized that this wasn't the case. This was an actual flying object and it appeared to fall in like a, a falling leaf motion. The silvery object sways back and forth like a pendulum at an altitude of about 15,000 feet. But as the meteor begins circling, the disc-shaped UFO stops and hovers in the air. It starts to rotate. And then it just went zoom and disappeared at some fantastic speed. And at that moment, they knew this wasn't something that they'd seen before. Nobody can find a rational explanation for the sighting. No cowling or parachute descends in the area. The experienced airmen watching claim it looks nothing like any aircraft they've ever seen. And it seems to move faster than a shooting star. 